Thanks for checking out this unboxing video. This is for the February regular BAM box. Um, always excited to get BAM box, always a fan. And let's get into it. Um, I remember, I don't remember all the properties or all that many of the properties. Mm, just maybe like two or so. But I do remember when I was looking, I was like, oh, it looks pretty good. So let's see how this pans out. That away. Tissue paper on the top from a cat, which is good because she had some. Um, the tissue paper we have accumulated for her is getting all shredded up because she likes to play in it, so she's been needing new tissue paper. So thank you, Bam Box, for getting my cat more tissue paper. Oh, um, might be a one up already. Yep, we're gonna have a one up. And I believe the yellow one up uh, means uh, the rare, one of the rarer versions of the pin. Not 100% on that, but I think. Um, ooh. So the first thing, oh, I'm, I have a feeling, I'm gonna, yeah, I have a feeling I know what this one is. Yep, it's exactly what I thought it was. So one of the properties was the X Files. Big X Files fan. I actually haven't watched any of the newer X Files, but I was huge into the older X Files. Big, big fan of that. Watched a lot of it. Um, so I kind of thought they would do something like this, or exactly this, which is obviously a Fox Mulder FBI badge. That's cool. Um, that's good for displaying um, if you want to. I mean, you can hang that up. You can just set it somewhere. Um, you could get another X-Files item and kind of do like a shadow box thing and include that. That's cool. For a small, like, whatever-ish item, that's cool. Um, my pin might not even be in here. Oh, shit. Well, <laughs> okay. Um, here we have... I don't even know what the hell this is. I don't know what this is. This is some sort of metal something. I have no idea what this thing is. It looks like some sort of, like, futuristic key or something. I don't know what the reference is. I'll have to look at the... I have no idea what that is. It's heavy. It's metal. It's good quality. I don't think I don't think I got a pin. Jesus Christ, they, they screwed up my horror um, BAM box last month. Dude, this is a problem. All right. Um, so this must be the piece of art, uh, and it's by Kyle Willis. Ah, it's legit. It's cool. So this is one of the properties they had. Um, the Black Panther obviously just came out recently, so you know they would probably do something like that. There's a nice print for Black Panther. And this is number 940 out of 2,000. Very cool. Um, looks good. Kyle Willis. Good artwork. I like it. And then another thing. Oh, I got two pieces of artwork. Oh, maybe that's what the one up is, is I'm getting both like the regular and the rare one. I don't know, we'll find out. This one's by Nathan Zerdy. Oh, and that's cool. I got number 206 out of 500 and it's Harley Quinn done as kind of like a war style pinup girl. I don't know, they used to do um, like pinup girl art on the side of like uh, planes and stuff like that for wartime and I'm pretty sure that this is kind of like a takeoff on that looks really good that's cool I'm excited about that two cool art prints I like that I like that a lot that's really cool and then the autograph who is this okay so it's someone from the show Supergirl I don't watch Supergirl um Laura Vandervoort and she was also in Smallville, apparently. Okay. So this was her in Smallville, although she's in um, Supergirl now. So, I mean, that's fine. I'm sure there's some people out there who are really going to like that autograph because they watch Supergirl. I've heard it's a good show, but I just haven't, just haven't checked it out. So let's check out the thing. Oh, I guess they didn't do a pin this, this month. Wow interesting they did not do a pin this month 
I don't think I like that. Uh, I really like uh, really like pins, man. All right, uh, that's it's just it's a bummer because I love those pins. I'm, if people watch enough of my unboxings, you know I'm always looking for the pin and the art print. The autographs are usually like a good plus if I really like them, but the pins and the art print, man, damn that sucks. Okay, so we got the autograph uh, Laura Vandervoort. Um, there are three different versions you could have gotten. Um, they're up here, as you can see. All these different ones. There you go. Let me get a little closer. All right. Then there were two different versions of the art print that we got um, from Kyle Willis. One of them was out of 500, and then the normal one that we got. And it looks like the one out of 500 just is kind of like, uh, looks worn, so it looks like it's like an older poster or something. So that's kind of cool. Um, then we had the badges. You could have got Dana Scully or Fox Mulder for the FBI badges from X Files. Not bad. This thing is a T800 CPU brain chip replica by Dark Matter Props. I guess that's from um, Terminator. Yeah, so. If I knew what that was, maybe I'd like it more. If people have, like, Terminator items or something, once again, like I said, with the FBI badge, putting this in, like, a shadow box with some more, one or more other items would be a cool thing. But, yeah, I mean, it just looks like exactly. Um, then there's the art print for the Harley one that we got. And they have two pictures, but I don't really see... Oh, there's such a small difference in this. So I guess there's like an out of 250 and an out of 500 or something. Or maybe one of them's regular. I don't know. It's kind of hard to know. But like, there's like a um, word bubble there. There's none there. And that's the only like real difference I can spot. So with those things, it's like the variants are like not really variants in my opinion, but whatever. I'm not going to show you the back because it has the properties for nec the next month and if people don't want to know it you know if you really want to know it you can check out the Facebook page for Bambox and they put it up so you can find it out uh, the giveaway they had going on was for a hand signed Funko Pop of Harley Quinn that was signed by Tara Strong who voices Harley in the video game Batman Arkham City so you can see it down there that's pretty cool Pops are fun to get. Okay, so, yeah, just, just bummed that there was no pin. I kind of wish they would have said up front, or maybe they didn't, I just missed it, but I don't think they said that there wasn't going to be a pin this time around. That just kind of bums me out. But the artwork is cool. Um, I got this, you know, variant piece of art of the Harley Quinn. Looks really nice. Um, very satisfied with the Black Panther art print. That's really cool. Don't really care about the autograph just because I don't really know the person. But I know some people who watch Supergirl, so maybe I can give it to them. FBI badge is decent for being a smaller item. And the, the Terminator brain chip, well made, looks good. But it doesn't really have a significance to me because I'm just not big into Terminator. Um, also, I'm going to admit this right now. I've only seen the first Terminator movie. And that's it. E. I know some people are probably like, what? Are you kidding me? Yeah, sorry. There's so many movies that I haven't seen that people are just like, I can't believe you haven't seen that movie. But, you know, it's just the way it is. Um, overall, good box. Liked it. I'm a fan. Always like band box. It's good stuff. Uh, can't wait to see with, mm -hmm, with these properties. The March regular box should be really good. And please have another pin. Please. I really want the pins back. Anyway, thank you everyone for checking out this unboxing. I'm also putting up a horror unboxing. I don't know if I'm putting it up the same day as this. I might, or if I'm going to wait and do it the next day, but within one day of this one being out. So uh, check that out too if you have interest. Um, please give me some likes. Um, that doesn't mean as much though, but subscribe please. Let people know about it. All that kind of good stuff. And until next time, keep it brutal.